A tornado touched down in Fort Lauderdale, Florida yesterday with that system that moved through as a classic supercell storm, perfect structure, wall cloud, and then an elephant trunk tornado touched down right in downtown Fort Lauderdale. And it hit a substation causing sparks to fly uh, with power flashes. And those sparks flying through behave like Lagrangian drifters, basically showing you the helical motion, vertical motion, as well as rotational, just outside of the condensation funnel, but also inside of the tornado core flow. And you can see those sparks rise showing you just how fast those vertical motions and updrafts can be near ground inside of a tornado. And a lot of times those vertical winds can be just as damaging as the horizontally rotating winds. This is a classic El Nino pattern, and I expect more tornado potential to arrive in Florida uh, Monday night late in the Florida Panhandle and then in the Florida Peninsula on Tuesday. And there definitely is a threat of at least a strong tornado or two across Florida, possibly up into southern Georgia and eastern South Carolina on Tuesday with a severe weather outbreak.